Well, it's very exciting to be here at Adelaide. It's the first time um, I've been here for 11 years. Came in and came in 2001, actually. So it's great to be back. And um, I'm here um, as a rider ambassador for HSBC um, to do a, a few things for um, Jill Rolton, the director, and a masterclass on Saturday morning in the main arena. So they, they're keeping me busy. You've had a look at the course. What's your general opinion of it? Oh, the course looks superb. I think um, it's, it's a very different course to, to what we're used to in Europe. It's, it's in a park. There's, um, there's lots of road crossings and ups and downs. Very, very like Greenwich, actually, the, um, the, the course we had there without the hills and um, gives you the same sort of feel. I think it looks, looks to me like the time will be very tight, very, very twisting and turning um, and, and quite decent. And I think because it's in a park and in an environment, it doesn't actually always look um, very inviting. I think the water jumps are both quite serious and um, it's going to take some jumping. You've spent a bit of time over here in Australia. What is eventing like as a sport over here? I think event, the event, eventing in Australia is, is a strong sport. Um, they do very well at it and um, they take it very seriously. I think it's, it's, it's tough being so far away. I think for them to compete um, on, a, on an international stage is, is a much tougher game um, than say it is, is for us in Europe. Um, but what they've got here is fantastic. Um, they've got some tremendous events and certainly this Adelaide event is, is one of the big features and, and one they target. Adelaide is the only four star down in the Southern Hemisphere. So what do you think the, this event means to Australians? Well, th this is a very popular event. I think they, they expect um, in the region of 20,000 um, spectators on, on cross country day. It's in the middle of a city, it's spectacular. And, and they're very proud of it. And um, it's so important that the Southern Hemisphere does have a four star event. I think this year, um, the entries are a little bit low, but it's Olympic year. so. Um, perhaps that's the reason for it. I think in the future you would hope that you know, they'd build up numbers and the, the number of two-star horses they've got here and the calibre of that will um, reflect um, up to four-star level. And um, one day I'd, I would love to compete here actually. And you've been to every other four-star. How do you think this one compares? I think every four-star is, is different and, and has got its own stamp. Um, and here we are in the middle of a city um, in Adelaide at a um, it's a beautiful setting, but not at all typical of, of what we see back home. And um, it's, it's, got its own, um, it's got its own demands. I think you've got the climate here, which can be quite extreme. Um, and as I say, you've got a, a lack of space. And you know, to get a four star in this park has been quite a challenge. And um, it'll certainly be a challenge to ride. And I would imagine every bit of four star track.